Hi. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm freaking the fuck out. I've literally missed you guys so much. What the fuck? The tripod I've just made is just not okay. I literally have like hairspray and a tub of lotion balancing precariously. Oh, precariously! She's smart or whatever. Um, hi. This is kind of awkward <laughs> oh yeah i have my hair in a fro right now i just want to get this out the way because i get really insecure when my hair is like just like in a puff when i just leave it be but i'm trying to just be like you know what shrinkage is real my hair is so healthy right now i think it's the healthiest it's been in a while i blow dried it like the other day i'll insert pictures i didn't really straighten it properly but i blow dried it and it just looked so cute picture here picture here picture here Oh my god, guys. Hi! Did you miss me? Did you miss me? I miss YouTube so much. You're probably looking at the title like, Kami, what the fuck? <laughs> no, like, for real, what the fuck? Also, ignore my nails. I tried painting on the other day. Since nail shops still aren't open. Or maybe they are now. What? I just can't wait to get my nails done. Oh my god. Anyway. Anyway, I'm like, my mind is going a thousand miles a minute because I've just... This is so weird. I've missed YouTube so much. Oh, my cupboard is open. Let me close it. And we'll get into where I've been and the reasoning behind the title of this video in a second. But, um, hope you guys are doing well. If you're new here, what's up? My name is Kami. I make videos on here, obviously. Oh, I've missed saying that. Ah! And if you're not new, welcome back, babe. Missed you. I literally have therapy in a minute. So I'm gonna go do that and then I'm gonna come back and chat to you guys and just explain where the F I've been. You know what I'm saying? Um, I did vlog like a month ago. I made this whole like getting my life together vlog. I started the vlog with me in bed and <laughs> that's the realest I've ever been with you guys. And basically I, <laughs> I made this whole speech about how I'm gonna be 110% myself on YouTube because I'm tired of trying to put on like my perfect face forward and I feel like my channel I'm always so freaking real with you guys so yeah I'll insert the clip of me explaining why now <sighs> this is not the usual way I start my vlogs I think I'm getting too comfortable here on YouTube <laughs> that's actually a lie I just like I'm tired of presenting like a forced always presentable version of myself on YouTube I've decided that I'm gonna be completely myself on my channel because you know why not I mean I, I am always myself while making videos but I don't always have to be like in makeup or pretty or presentable because that's unrealistic I've been thinking about what direction I want to take my channel in like what is my niche because I don't really have like a niche and most of the comments I get on my videos or DMs from you guys is that like I'm so authentic <laughs> I'm so hey fuck i'm so authentic i'm so authentic and i'm real and i don't like you know try and like be this perfect youtuber and that really means a lot to me when i hear that from you guys so i just say that yes yeah, that's, that's just gonna be me my niche whatever i want to make i'll make no pressure to always have the perfect video and the perfect ideas if you watched my i think it was my previous video now i haven't been on youtube for weeks sorry about that it was my previous video where my friend said like i'm too much of a perfectionist where they absolutely roasted me for things they hate about me i love that video if you haven't watched that video check it out and you know sometimes that tends to get in the way of a lot of things that I want to do, you know. So, now that I've decided that my channel will be me being my authentic self and also like taking you guys on this journey with me. It sounds so like LA, like on this journey. I'm just gonna take you guys on. <laughs> like it sounds like those like zen girls. Why I wanna do this is because I feel like it helps others as well. Like when I talk about mental health or when I talk about my experiences I've gone through and I always like leave some advice in there. Like even the, like the dating in your 20s video. Like I always somehow just leave a bit of advice in there and those are the videos I love the most. Yeah, I guess what I'm saying is like I'm your big sister on YouTube now and I'm gonna take you on like whatever journeys life takes me through 
and we're gonna learn together grow together be real together have fun together you know on the times where i'm feeling like a beauty girl and like doing like beauty fashion stuff that too because i really really do love fashion if you're not already following me on instagram follow me on instagram I'm planning on making more fashion content i am your big sister cami i like i always say i don't care if you're older than me <laughs> When it comes to this YouTube channel, I'm still your big sister. And I will give advice. Even if you didn't ask for the advice, I'm going to give you advice. Because I feel like I'm good at it. Because I have amazing friends that give me advice. So yeah, I look like a burrito. <laughs> and then, during this getting my life together vlog, I waxed myself for the first time, my underarms, for the first time on camera for you guys with my friends. So you get to see that here as well. Guys, I just, I just want moral support for like one fucking I'm second. Coming, I'm coming. The wax has melted and my trusty assistants are gonna help me apply it because I can't apply it for shit, like evenly. So, okay, I'm gonna give Shakisha a start. To apply on my do that one and I'll do that one. And don't worry, I'm in a bralette. It's not a bra, it's a bralette. I think so, Which right? are you meant to go with the grain or against the grain? I don't know. Um, <laughs> go up. Yeah. Oh, so oh, against. It depends okay. the kind of wax. <laughs> I think you put it on down. with and rip against. Oh, okay. So yeah, 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 yeah. Up to down. Yeah, up to down and then here it is. I'm telling you, just vibe. Like the worst thing can no, happen is you have to I'm just saying, yes, it's gonna burn. Ooh. Ooh. Is it hot? Of this. Ah! Is it like. Damn. Nah, I we have like to hurry because it's hardening. Wait, should we pull it? I'm so scared. Should I do the other one? Don't even count down. Just Me rip now. it off when she's not looking. No. Me? No, 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 no. I don't know why I thought this is a good idea. Can I, I don't fucking do this for you. <laughs> Jack, you can. Yeah. Can I rip it off? Okay. No, it's not that painful. Just look at that. Look how satisfying that is. Yeah, but like. Sterilize. Why did I choose to do this? Nothing about it. The pain Just is look like at a that. tattoo. The pain is a lot more than look your Look how cool that is. It's not that bad. Do you know what I mean? You're not me. You're not a pussy. You're Are you already doing it? <gasps> oh! okay. It did hard it. Ah! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Do I do it? Should I do it? Wait. No, wait, no, it needs to be harder. harder. Needs to be harder. Fuck. Because the worst Fuck. is when it comes off in bits and bits. But it was ah, nice. It was, it, was, little... it, was, it was worse than I thought. The little bit looks nice. Well, the worst. Yeah. No, that bit is it smooth. Looks smooth. It's perfect. Nice. Nah, it's actually fine. She you can really it. sweat yourself out now. It's anticipation that I'm sweating, bro. Really. <laughs> I'm actually sweating, bro. At D4. D4 thumbnails. Mm. I reckon that's. <laughs> Maybe. Why don't you put it? Yeah, the other one. Yeah, I'll play the other one. Because I'm back out. Yeah, because this is getting like this is not looking This is what women have to do! No, I think it looks fine. We can't just leave the pit like this. Take it off. No, I'm saying this is too thin a layer. Oh, it's I'm sweating! Wait! It's so funny that I was doing a getting my life together vlog and then immediately after I finished vlogging, my life literally fell apart. Not even joking. Hence the title. But yeah! Anyway, 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 oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm late for therapy. Okay, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Love you, I'll see you. Don't miss me too much. Okay, okay, bye. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, guys, I'm actually low key feeling the pro. <laughs> I just called my mom and she was like, Why did you cut your hair? And I was like, I didn't cut my hair, mom. It's called shrinkage. Anyway, so I just had therapy and now I'm gonna go chill with my friends in the sitting room even though I know they're working. But I'll just like be like a quiet encourager. Yeah. Hello. Okay. Yeah, I'm in a little afro today. Hello. Look at a student hard at work. Can't relate. Yeah, cheers. Hi, I look 
Lex that got us ice cream. Thank you, Lex. Oh, it's so pretty. It's a rose. And we're watching a cheesy rom com. Watching cheesy rom com. Ice cream. It's a good day. She go come see. She goes back from outside. Have you missed? Have you missed these guys? Have you missed? Hi guys. We missed you. We missed you. <laughs> Guys, if you need a cheesy rom com to watch with your girls, but you're like defo over 18, <laughs> watch yeah. The Sweetest it's Thing. It's amazing. It's so good. Lex it's just showed it to me. Thing. It's the. Oh. Good one. Good one. <laughs> Um, guys, Shiko went to the Asian market today or Asian Hello. store and she got mochi So I'm gonna try it if you guys haven't seen mochi you're clearly not on TikTok But these little balls these little dessert I knew about this before Oh my uh, god, she's so edgy You want the matcha one? Um, okay, what flavor is it then? There's matcha, milk, and red bean I'll try matcha Red bean? Red bean. Yeah, I gotta try the original bean. Thank you. Okay, so I'm trying the matcha one. Please ignore my nails. Oh no. Ooh. Oh no. It's so squishy. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Oh. It's literally so squishy. Okay, You're wait. Supposed to eat this soup. Soup? It's a dessert. Okay, wait. I'll do half. Mmm. Mmm. No. Mmm. I don't love it. What do you think, Sham? I taste the matcha for sure. Oh yeah, it's very much right. What flavor is this? Red bean. red bean. I think there's red bean inside all of them. Oh yeah. That's, that, that's what the liquid is. Mm. I was expecting them to be sweeter. Yeah, I was expecting something nice and fluffy and like sweet. And try this one. And yummy. It's safe to say I'm mm. not impressed. I mean, I, I get it, but... I actually think I might prefer the I red prefer bean. I prefer the matcha one. I think I might prefer the red this bean. This one is very. It's like a, it's like I'm eating. Taste. Oh, for me it's like I'm eating beans, like Giveri. But <laughs> I think mochi is it. Oh, I think mochi is Japanese. I don't oh. know. Oh. Anyways, I've I've heard that you shouldn't like a lot. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm not trying You shouldn't get your hopes up when you know Westerners try mochi because mm. like people in Asian countries, they're used to that flavor mm. of red bean. Mm. Right. The milk one is the best out of all of them. Yeah, that's saying a lot. <laughs> <laughs> but I think we need to go somewhere we get fresh ones, like ones that aren't in a packet. And maybe. It's like white chocolate. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's not how white chocolate tastes. Mm. <laughs> Peace and love to the Asian community. Peace and love. Peace and love. <laughs> peace and love to the oh, Asian no, community. No, no, no. But no, maybe I need to go get some like authentic yes. ones and then I'll try again because I do really like the concept of it. What if I just ate this? I don't know. Oh, it's five o'clock somewhere. Oh. Guys, spring is really springing. Look at our tree. The tree is really saying springtime. Shiko is just thinking about insects guys meet our pride and joy the number one person in our family our trolley Yay. Oh, she has been with us for only about a month but already she's changed our lives a great chair a great, a great place to take pictures, pictures. you know if, if someone is carrying a lot of stuff we might there's no way actually how are we how did you guys get this in here let's not talk about that okay <laughs> that evening that fateful evening okay guys i know i said good night but i just need to share a story <laughs> that just happened to me right now i don't know why i'm like this first of all but basically i was scrolling through tiktok as i do you can see i'm like really tired my eyes are puffy and everything and I was going through TikTok and I stumbled across this random like psychic woman's live and she was basically like using crystals and stuff to like predict the future like the people in the comments future so people are asking is a guy I'm dating my soulmate will I get the job blah 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 so I was like you know what? fuck it <laughs> I have time today I typed in the comments and I was like there's no way she's gonna pick my comment there's no way she's gonna pick my comment anyway because like so many people were commenting so I was like I asked the one question that matters the most to me I was like Will I be successful in the career I want? She rolls the crystals and everything and it points to no. And she's like, oh, Kami, she picks me. She picks me and she's like, oh, Kami, it's a no from the universe. And I was like, fuck the universe. <laughs> and I was like actually upset for like five minutes. I was like, I even texted one of my friends. I was like, this random psychic on TikTok live just said I won't be successful. 
in the career I want. Bless her, she was trying to be like so nice. She was like, hey, maybe you need to just rethink career path. And I'm like, what if I'm stubborn? <laughs> anyway, that's why I've been upset for the last 10 minutes of my life. But fuck that. Fuck her and the universe. <laughs> I'm gonna be successful <laughs> and whatever the fuck I put my mind to and thank you to my friend who was texting for reminding me that even Zenya was in the kitchen she was like coming like it's gonna be okay but I just don't know why I'm like this like why am I participating in some random psychic TikTok lives I didn't think she'd pick me but she picked me I'm, I mean I'm gassed but now I'm not gassed because she said I'm gonna be jobless I'm kidding that's not what she said anyway on that note <laughs> good night Hi guys. Oh, is it still dead? Hi guys. What did you think of my outfit? isn't she cute happy wednesday it's wednesday today and i just thought like i'd get cute let me show you in the mirror i've become like too tall for my mirror which i don't even understand how this top is from shein this necklace is top shop these jeans you guys if you don't know where these jeans are <laughs> from by now i can't help you but the american apparel you know the jeans i always wear and look it's kind of like open at the back i don't know if i've tied it correctly but yeah, it's like open up the back booty. Feeling like a bad bitch, not gonna lie to you. I cut my old wig into like this little fringe thing. It's a bit messy, but I literally spent four hours trying to perfect it. But this is how it looks now. After a little wash and blow dry, it's still a bit stringy. I don't know what I need to do to make this wig look brand new again, but I don't know, mate. I really don't know. But um, you know the way these jeans are a bit too big for me? I tried that hack where you like kind of tuck, you hook your thingy into the first hole of the belt. Does that make sense? So like I basically hooked the button into the first of these on this side. It looks a bit awkward, but maybe I can hide it in photos, but it, it helps it fit so much better. I feel so much better with it like this. But it just looks a bit weird because it like bunches up here. Do you see that it bunches up? Anyway, basically today all I've done is get ready, catch up with friends and family. Guys, should I? I still owe you guys an explanation for the title. Hang tight for that. But this is just a weekly vlog, you know what I mean? Should I put these? <gasps> Bitch. Oh my god. How much of a look is that? Are you joking? She's giving you Matrix vibes. Oh my god, I'm kind of obsessed. I used to have a fringe back when my hair was relaxed, when I was like 12. I used to have a fringe and everyone would ask me <laughs> if my hair was real because obviously when you have palm, it was like dead straight and my hair used to be quite long. So I kind of look like old Cami, but like leveled up because she a baddie. Okay, so now I'm making Shiko take photos of me. I was gonna go to like town and stuff, but bit long in it oh you look so pretty beautiful. your hair is nice thank you i am loving the fit thank you did you cut the band yeah this is the, my old wig so really i took like yeah. three four hours doing it it's just a bit uneven but like i did it in a way where i could also like do like side bangs oh, yeah, if you wanted like to. curtains Ooh, yeah guys nice. she got braided her own hair look how pretty she looks look at her Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. Hey kiddos, so we've just finished taking photos in the park. It's freezing by the way and I'm wearing this cajolta. But the real star of the day is this girl right here, Elizabeth from Jaco Kigoshi. <laughs> no, honestly, she thank you again. Yeah. Like, <laughs> thank you, thank you. I know, <laughs> I look like amazing. <laughs> no, literally, she is my director, photographer, content advisor. Now we're just heading back home. Good morning kiddos, it's Friday, Woo! it's Friday and I'm up early. I got up at like 7am but that's because of anxiety. Oh, my fan is on, let me turn it off. Good morning everybody, Um, I just got up, well it's 10 now, I got up at around 7am which is like crazy for me, who is she? Let me put you guys down, my PJs 
are from Shein. So it's like these, these little shorties and this top. How cute! So today, my friends and I are going to the pub. Honestly, finding a booking is an extreme sport. Like, my anxiety was going 110 miles per hour trying to find a booking. Like, all of last night and all of this morning, my friends and I have been trying to find a place. But I finally found a place. And we're going pub because, obviously, it's only outdoor seating right now in the United Kingdom. They better have heaters because... The way the weather is set up, they were really actually smart to open outdoor seating when the weather was still a bit dodgy because it will like reduce the number of people that want to go out because it's still quite cold. So yeah, that's what, uh, that's what we're getting up to. I've just finished watching the episode. Do you guys watch Invincible? If you watch Invincible, comment down below because I've just finished watching the season finale. What the fuck? Guys, what the fuck was that? Anyway, if you know, you know. If you watch Invincible, you know what I'm talking about because tapped. I've already had breakfast. Like I said guys, I woke up really anxious and I told a friend of mine and they sent me breakfast to cheer me up. Literally. 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 I don't know how they did it, but they managed to get my address and they sent me breakfast and it was so yummy. I'm just gonna chill, drink some water, catch up on some YouTube content. I'm so happy it's the weekend. Not that it makes a difference for me <laughs> these days because drop out i need to stop saying i'm a drop out because it's not the full truth <laughs> and i still haven't explained myself to you guys <laughs> again if you do want a video explaining of me explaining my situation do let me know i've always wanted to talk about it though because you know very open on this channel and like i said me and you we're on this journey together we're on this journey together sis or bro or they like i said inclusive <laughs> i'm actually so full of shit today all right bye guys Hey kiddos! <laughs> hey, so I'm done getting ready. Guys, it's raining! It's literally raining. I hate it here. I specifically requested when I was making the booking for the pub that I wanted like covered outdoor seating. So I hope we get it. But this is not it. But you know, it's good to leave the house. It's okay if it's raining. It's England, like nothing new there. Like we're used to it, I guess. But anyway, I'm all casual today. I'm just wearing jeans and a white tee and I'm gonna put this flannel over it And yeah, nothing special. Just a little casual day. My wig's a bit messier today But I like how it's like wavier when I don't straighten it. So we're just gonna say this is like a natural vibe <laughs> This is intentionally messy. Even the fringe is a bit. It's moving a bit mad, but I'll fix it later I'm gonna go chill with my friends and I'll check in with you guys when we're at the pub okay i know i said i'll check in with you guys when we're at the pub but i literally walked into the kitchen and look what these guys are doing like what the fuck these bitches are painting no, your friends are even yeah i like this color just pattern, the poster, just, you know? yeah we're just here to vibe i think i was using a reference picture i can't really draw i'm just here for fun it's just vibes it's, it's just really cool that i walked out of my room and these guys are just like fucking painting drinking wine like it's such a cute friday so cute oh my gosh guys i've got my sunglasses oh how are you gonna live how am i gonna be a bad baby it's so sunny sunglasses? how can that's you crazy live? Look at you, I forgot it. Like, look at this lovely weather. Okay, you know what? The first, the first thing you need to understand is God gave me pretty eyes. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So it's my eyes that you've been looking at today. Because right. with my sunglasses in the rain. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah! So we're here, guys. We're at the pub. It's actually like very bougie. I love it. Like, it's, it's so, so cute. cute. It's, it's so aesthetic. Okay, I'm going to try sneakily film um, the surroundings. But Shiko and Lex are in the loo and Andrea's meeting us. And dress here. Oh, my God, she looks so beautiful. I don't, I don't like the back. Yeah, I don't like the back. Next American movie. Yeah. 
you know the type of cars with the secret agents behind? Yeah, yeah, it's that kind of car. Yeah, yeah it's very yeah. cool. Yeah. That's why I like them. The cool. I mean, they are kind of cool, but there's wow, another one. I think. Mirrors. I think the GLC is mirrors. nice. This is a GLS, but the GLC is quite nice. But this one's a diesel as well. No. I have no idea if this is the other one. Well, I think this is a lovely car. It, it is nice. Shamsa. No, I feel like you guys are just on it because it's Mercedes. Personal. I think I'm it's more nice. of a 90 person. Oh, oh yeah. Same. same. I would like I'm more of a Mercedes person. Out. What do you guys think? Do you guys like the big Mercedes? Oh, like the GLS, like? the GLC. I like big cars. Oh, yeah. Big car guys, this is where I used to live in first year. Oh, I used to live there. That's my room. Yeah, your room is just down there. This is where me and Andy used to live. Hey, girlies. Hi. As you can tell, it's a different day, different situation, different vibe. And that's because a lot happened <laughs> after we went out for cocktails. So the last clip you saw was actually last Friday. Today's Thursday for the following week. And after we got home from cocktails, we decided let's go out and ride these electric scooters that everyone rides in my area in Birmingham. So we're like, yeah, we've always wanted to do it. <laughs> let's go out for some fun, right? And it was going so well. But me being me, <laughs> me being the most uncoordinated person I know, and also just being like afraid of cars. In my defense, a car came towards us. Anyway, I fell down, right? And I happened to fall on my face and hand. My hand's more or less fine now. Still a bit injured, this bone, but I'm fine, we're all fine. I was bleeding everywhere. My front teeth did go into my lip a little bit. Uh, had to go to a &E, obviously. Waited there for five hours and had to get emergency braces, as you can see, which is just... <sighs> Yeah. Anyway, so I've been dealing with that for the past week. My face has been swollen for so long, but I'm feeling so much better now. I'll insert pictures of what it looked like. My face was literally like, have you guys ever watched The Grinch or any Dr. Seuss thing that includes the Who people, like from Whoville, like Horton Hears a Who? I look like a Who person. I look like a who. It was just so bad. Right now I'm feeling a lot better. Still a bit of pain in my teeth and jaw because they were so loose. Thank God they didn't come out of the socket, but they were loose enough where I needed to get these emergency braces. So yeah, that's what I've been dealing with. So I didn't manage to film an outro, so I guess this is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you do want an explanation of this title, why I dropped out of university, so to speak. Please do let me know and I'll be happy to chat about it to an extent. Uh, yeah, I hope you guys are doing well though. Hope you guys are good. And I am so happy to be back on YouTube. Happy to be back making videos. If you're new here, subscribe. Might as well join the fam now that I'm back. Love you guys. Those